The term family is generally associated with a sports team. On the Husky wrestling team, that term is taken more literally. Uh, Brett and I have been wrestling for probably about 15 years. We both started when we were in kindergarten, first grade. For Josh, he started a little bit younger than I did. He started, I think, at the year four, and I uh, started wrestling when I was like five years old. So he started about a year after I did. Uh, Jake and I have been wrestling since about first or second grade. I was in second grade and he was in first grade and uh, we got flyers in our school mailbox about the, the neighborhood wrestling team and uh, so we brought it home and that's how it uh, started. I was really happy when I heard Josh was going to make the transfer and come to St. Cloud State. Uh, he was having a lot of uh, stress and whatnot at Hastings. He called me up uh, in December and just saying he was dealing with a lot and so to hear that he wanted to make that decision to transfer up to St. Cloud, I, I knew it was a, a decision that was a long time coming. coming. Coming up here to St. Cloud to be with my brother and to be on a really successful team was a really big step for me and I'm really grateful that I, that I chose to be up here. I wasn't really pushing him one way or the other, I wanted it to be all his decision. So if he went somewhere else I was going to be happy, if he came here I was going to be happy and he ended up coming here which was an awesome decision, you know, get to go to school together for another four years. A lot of people wouldn't want to go to school with their siblings and kind of Throughout the whole process of picking where I was going to go to college, I was unsure whether I wanted to go with him or whether I just wanted to go out on my own. And I'm, I'm very happy with the decision of picking to go to the same school as him and again being on the same team as him for wrestling. As in any brotherhood, competition and criticism helps you grow. We're always very competitive in everything that we do, whether it's a board game or wrestling or especially ping pong. We're, we really like playing ping pong against each other. My parents, they just came up to watch us wrestle this last week and they, they bought a bunch of ping pong balls back home because we, I guess we break them every time. He, he is probably more, a little more critical on me because I tend to make more mistakes. If he sees me do something wrong, he's going to let me know, but I don't know, I'd probably say I'm on his case more just because, I don't know, maybe that older brother mentality. We try and help each other out as much as we can, critiquing or even just showing each other what we did wrong from match to match. Uh, wrestling is a really nice sport to have like somebody, like a brother along with you because it's something you just need one person to kind of get better with, to wrestle with. And so it's something that Brett and I can just do in our basement and just like kind of wrestle with each other. Even when it's like not necessarily uh, for the sport, but you're just kind of getting into an argument and start wrestling. He, he's able to light that fire, which is good for me. It helps me um, bring that high intensity level that I need to bring to all my uh, matches and all my uh, wrestling uh, techniques. But I mean, he gets a little bit more chippiness than anybody else in the room. I think he knows that. I think he, uh, he detests to that as well. But I think it uh, helps both of us grow and it helps both of us uh, push each other. These wrestlers will always have a practice partner. I think I've always like looked up to my brother and having him on the same team as me, being able to like see him in the same practice room and just he really is a big reason why I've uh, progressed in wrestling. It's easy to call like family over the phone but like just having that person here with me and having Josh uh, being a couple blocks away that I can uh, call up and go go talk to or talk to in the wrestling room afterwards, it's definitely going to help each of us uh, keep our heads on head on a, a level pace there and uh, just be able to stay focused uh, throughout the course of the season. It's pretty cool. I don't know if a lot of people can say they've been on the same team for 20 years with one person and uh, I don't know, I think it makes it a lot better because then you have someone to always talk to. It's more positive than negative because he's always there if I need something. He's always helping me and then obviously he's my brother so he'll just give a little jab at me every once in a while but he's always been a positive influence and just help me grow in the sport and as a person. Thank you.